What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2020 Panini Donruss Elite Football. Six box half case break. Pick your teams number two. Just sold out. Second half of the Master. I know, Mark. Dennis Dixon should have won the Heisman. They should have went to the National Championship, but towards ACL and they lost to Arizona when they were number two. Nick got the Raiders, it looks like. Last ball mojo. And that's what sells it out. But that's all right. Mariota, Heisman, Herbert, Stud. It's okay. Uh, actually, guys, hold on. Let me bring my knife. Actually, that's the only thing I don't have. Yeah, that, the stadium is very nice. I'm not gonna. I'll give it to Jerry. Cowboy Stadium is pretty nice, or AT&T Stadium, sorry. But um, I think this new Rams and and uh, Chargers fight. Uh, is it? What is not? Fi it's not Fico. Uh, what is the other? Le SoFi. That's right. SoFi Stadium is gonna just blow that one out of the water. That stadium looks amazing already. So yeah, dude. I've been, I've been driven by. It's it. gonna look. It's way. It looks way better than AT and T. Like it's just gonna be like crazy. Isn't that crazy? And AT and T's not even that old. I know, dude. It's like 2008 or something. Yeah. I heard like I and I've driven by Legion a few times. Yeah. Over the last couple of years, and that that team. Looks that the Raiders stadium, stadium looks really cool too. Yeah. Too. They're getting the draft again next year, so. Yeah. That's what I said. I wonder if there is no season for some reason. Would they just push the schedule back? So, like, would the Eagles, like, just have to play this year's schedule next year? Probably. Probably, right? Yeah, well, that'd be probably. good for me. All right, do you anything before I go? No, I'm good, man. Thank you. All right, man. Please. I'll see you uh, tomorrow. That's right. You're in tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. Oh, nice, Mark. You got the Bengals and the Chiefs and the Chargers. Nice, Mark. Well, good luck. Get some Herbert, baby. Yeah. Now, now that I want to go down memory lane, jeez. The next two games I went to after the Cowboys game was 2017. Super Bowl champion year. Bittersweet, though. First game I went to was the Chargers game here in uh, the 30,000 arena soccer field for the Galaxy play. That was really cool. That was just like a once-in-a-lifetime experience. See an NFL game. In 30,000 seat venue. Eagles beat the Chargers. It was great. Next one I went to. Sad times. Played against the Rams. Carson Wentz tore his ACL that game. But it was such an amazing game. Jordan Love. Well, Jay Hart. But that was fun. Nice. Awesome, man. Yeah, like I said, this new arena looks crazy as hell. Jake Luton. And, well, there's a Herbert to start us off right there. Logan Wilson. And look at this. Miko Harmon. That's a four out of five. Full throttle. Tom Brady, how about that? Six out of 12. Wow, this is really sharp printed. Nice. Who has the Who has the Buccaneers? Michael Blunt. I know you're a big Bucks fan, right? You're going to like that. Joey Bosa. Jordan Love.
Darrington Evans. Jalen Rigor, new Eagles weapon right there. Speedy receiver out of TCU. And Antonio Gandhi Golden to 199. Redskins. Brenna Patrick. Elite. And we'll randomize those. I, I think what I did was um, I just did front one, two, three, four. And then it went to the respectful team on there. And threads to 299 is Rod Woodson. Jeff Okuda. Jimmy G. And a Noah for the Dolphins. Alright, remember guys, uh, this is the only break that is sold out. So if you guys want to do any more group breaks tonight, whether it's another Elite, whether it's, um, you know, the Mixer, the Jaspies High End Hit Pack, Summertime Hit Pack. You know, we are pretty close on all those breaks. Uh, Obsidian, full case break. Pick your team, number five. That's our last case right there. Seven left. A couple teams are in the $200 range, but remember, guys, $200 is going to get you that team in a 12-box case break. So, I mean, not a bad not a bad shot. I mean, these boxes are still, I think we have them on sale for $450. You're still paying pretty much half a box price. To potentially get some major hits for those big teams. And I think it's like Washington, like Detroit with Saku and Rui. So, if they're a little pricey like that, just because they have pretty solid rookies. But then there's also underrated teams, too. They may not have the biggest rookie yet. You know, very underrated players. But they probably have a loaded checklist maybe for veterans. So, I think doing that 12-box break of Obsidian would be pretty fun. You know, that's... Been sitting up there for quite some time, so I know some people would definitely love to get that done. But like I said, if if um, you know, it kind of dies down after this elite, and no one wants to break anymore, then again, you guys here that are also watching can get personal boxes on Jaspies.com with me, and I could break them here for you. Um, and like I said, if not, then. I'll turn on the Instagram too, and we can try to get some Instagram customers to come over here as well. So, I plan to be here like around 12, one the latest if I was really, really busy. But, like I said, if it just dies down, I get it. You know, we did a lot of breaks today, pre orders again for tomorrow, uh, new release, then I'll be back again at 10 o'clock. So, we could probably do that mixer early and get that out of the way. All right, to 99, Henry Ruggs for the Raiders. Stud linebacker Kenneth Murray for the Chargers. Kind of wanted the Eagles to draft him, but I was okay with Rigor after. Jalen Johnson. DJ Chark. And we got for the Chiefs, Len Dawson to 49. Then a Rocio. Derek Henry. T. Higgins for the Bengals to 49. And Nick Bosa to 25. PJ Hamler. Another Kenneth Murray.
Tristan Fulton. Yeah, we can do another lead if you guys want to, guys. Like I said, I'm going to be here at least till midnight, so by the time I get done with this break, it gives us pretty much close to like two hours left. And like I said, if it does die down, I will do some personals on Instagram. Jake from, so, and that includes you guys if you guys want to do personals. I just uploaded a fresh case of museum collection. Ryan Tannehill to 99. Ross Blacklock. Jordan, uh, Julian Edelman. T. Higgins. All right, next one. What's up, Bart? I appreciate it, man. I am on a little bit. A little bit on that journey. <laughs> uh, Jason, well, we occasionally do mixers. Most, well, most, mostly like once a week, once every two weeks. Um, as of late, like the last couple of days, we have done a little bit more than usual, but at least once or twice a week. Uh, but I don't know about other places. Yeah, so we have group breaks here, jazbeescasebreaks.com. And, um, yeah, I mean, like I said, we have a couple breaks that I think we can still fill up tonight. So, get it going. Like I said, I plan to be here till around midnight, so for about another two hours. Remember, I'm back again at 10 in the morning, guys, so... Drive home for about 45 minutes if I leave at 12. But I probably won't leave at 12 by the time I clean up and everything. So I say I leave at 1, drive home, get there at 2, go to sleep, wake up, boom, back here at 10 o'clock. So if we don't feel any breaks, don't worry, guys. We will break again in about 12 hours or less than 12 hours when, by the time I'm done later. But like I said, if group breaks stall, uh, stall um, then I can do personal boxes. So we have two separate websites, guys, for you guys that are new here. This is the case breaking side, but on Instagram, at Jaspies Breaks, we do uh, personal boxes on this website right here. But tonight, I can do them here for you guys on YouTube while I'm here. Check it out. I know, I should have brought a, I should have brought like a little sleeping bag or something, right? Chris McCaffrey, but actually, guys. So I mean, I'm I'm moving in, moving to my wife's and I's new place this weekend, which is like six miles from the beach here. So no more 35 mile commute one way, 70 round trip for me. So I'll be more available to break, and much closer. <laughs> oh, Chase Young. Mitchell Trubisky. Oh man, Rebel, I wish houses here were like 200,000. <laughs> I would have got one already. <laughs> I mean, not that I would have paid it off or anything, but I think the mortgage would have been like $1,000 a month. Yeah. <laughs> California, four bedroom, three bath, two, two, 2,000 square feet is like probably like a million dollars. Depending on the area, probably more. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. Closer to this area, one bedroom, one bath is around 2,000, guys. Think about that. that is, it's crazy. Apartment, too. Yeah, not a house. James Morgan. Jake Luton. Yeah, we gotta get, we gotta, we gotta get Jaspies out of Cali. <laughs> we can all just have, we can all just have mansions. Like just, we could just like buy a street and all just live in a house around each other. <laughs> Michael Thomas. So yeah, guys, keep me breaking, guys. I need, be, I need to be able to pay for rent. <laughs> I'm just joking. Terry Kill. Mitch. T. Higgins. I know, dude. I mean. I'm paying a little little high where we're at, but it's it's pretty nice. It's kind of newly renovated stuff, so I'm okay with it. Ben Jefferson, James Morgan. But yeah, some some parts though. Probably could find some new. Ooh, Clyde Edwards Hilaire. It's 149 for the Chiefs. No, I already ate winner right now before I got off things. No, Brad, that there is a lot of people like that that are definitely scoring right now. Yeah, a lot of people have like rent control and stuff, so they probably have been there for like, you know, 15, 20 years, whatever it is, right? And I know people like that. Where like they've been there they've been at their apartment or whatever it is for like 10, 15 years and like you know, I think, I think they paid like, I don't know, let's call it like a thousand dollars, like fifteen years ago, right? And, but it was like a three bedroom apartment, right? Like, you know, a little over a thousand, which fifteen years ago that's a lot of money. But obviously now with the times, like, when people rent out rooms now, you can almost charge, I mean, just as much for a room as what you're paying for like the three bedroom. So, subleasing is like. <laughs> Is like it's like the best thing now if you have like that kind of thing, you know? Because I mean, you can literally make money off of people living in your place. <laughs> like I just met with uh, one of the ladies that. Um, is the manager that manages the two apart two apartment complexes, and uh, she was just like, "Yeah, I've been living in this complex for like 29 years." I'm like, "How much do you pay for rent <laughs> for you to be living there for like 20 plus years?" Like, I was like, "Good God." We still got three boxes, Christian. We're halfway through the break, so we'll get you some good stuff. All right, we got Tredavious White, Jacob Eason, Kenny Galladay. Oh, for the Lions, Jeff Okuda. Deshaun Watson. Full of 
full throw out of 75, Debo Samuel. Debo, Debo. Tommy Stevens to 199 for the Saints. And Grant Delpit to 24 for the Browns. Jonathan Taylor, how about that, to 99, turn of the century. Indianapolis Colts. Who has the Colts in this break? Jeremy Merle. There you go. Full throttle to 99. Minka Fitzpatrick. Jared Judy. Gallimore. Look at that. There's a little Calwood for you. Hopefully more. To 99. And for the 49ers, little Nick Bosa. Michael Armstrong with that one. Steven Montes. And Patrick Queen. Isaiah Simmons, 2399. Full throttle. Brandon Wilson. And Cole Met for the Bears. Pen pals. The Bears, Chris Maxwell. Nice. I don't, I don't think it's that price anymore. Silver Lake, right? But yeah, 550 square feet. It's a little tiny, but... I mean, if it's just like you or, you know, by yourself or maybe, you know, another person, I guess it's not too bad, but you kind of always want a little bit more room, you know, if you could find it for the right price. Jessamy, what's going on? seem like that but you know not many people can live this lifestyle <laughs> After a couple of years, right, you got to start thinking about investing that money, especially at that price, you know? Because, I mean, property value is only gonna, it's always going to go up. You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's like, if you can pay for it, I mean, you're never going to lose money. At least, at, least that's what, at least that's what I think. I mean, I guess depending on the area and how, the, how, shape, how good of a shape the, the, the house is or the property is, but, I mean... You're just, I don't know. I don't just feel like you're never going to lose any money. Yeah, probably, Rex. I mean, 
I think most of the minimum wage in California is pretty much at 15 bucks an hour now. But, you know, that the cost of living is going up as well. So it kind of just doesn't doesn't mean like, oh, you're going to be making so much money for 15 bucks. Because I'm sure there's some states that are pretty low. But the cost of living is different. But, I mean, I, I, I mean, I grew up here. I don't know anything else but California. But when I leave California, <laughs> I just realize how expensive it is. You know, when I travel or like, I mean, even just going to Arizona, Nevada, Vegas, just four or five hours away, borderline, you see how the price difference is. But don't get me wrong, there's, I mean, if you want to stay in California for California, there is places in California that are pretty affordable. But it's not going to be near any major city, probably, I'll tell you that. So... I mean, I, I don't know. I guess California is just the weather. You just can't really beat it. I don't know. I just, I, I just like, I, I talk, to, I tell it to my dad all the time. Like, my dad, well, you know, my dad came uh, from Mexico over here, and he, he, you know, his brother brought him to California. I'm like, why'd you guys come to California? You know, and they're just like, well, California was just like the place to be, you know. And I, he just always talks about, like, the weather. And it's just crazy how the weather is in L.A. People, I mean, you can travel 30 miles one way, 30 miles the other way. Um, and you can get every everything you want. <laughs> you got the beach, you got the mountains, you got the desert. You know, it's pretty crazy. And obviously, so much things to do here. I think job opportunities as well. It's, there's just a vast variety. Darrington Evans for the Tennessee Titans. You know, some people may not think it's worth it, which is cool, you know, but I mean, I feel like here there's just so much you can do here. But like I said, I've never experienced living anywhere else, so I guess I can't really say too much. Chris Godwin. KJ Hamler to 99, turn of the century. Denver Broncos, Steve Reese. But, you know, being more of an adult now, you, you kind of just realize that it's, you know, it's uh, pretty pricey to live here. So, like my. My in-laws, my wife's parents, they moved to Arizona. They moved to Arizona um, a couple months ago. My father-in-law's job relocated to Arizona. So they helped move them out, you know. And they got a house for like 225000 Three bedroom. Very nice. With a nice little pool. Swagger. Kenny Gallagher to 49, and he even realized how crazy it is to live over there. You know what I mean? Like, he was just like, Jesus. Like, the, the rent mortgage is like $1,000. You know? And he still, you know, thankfully gets the pay that he had in California, so cost of living is much less than Arizona, so. Ooh, nice little Justin Herbert. But... That usually doesn't happen to many of us, right? I mean, if we move out, relocate to a new new state, you're most likely not getting the same pay if your job didn't go out there. You know what I mean? Yeah, Needles is cool. I mean, that's where Laughlin's at. I, my, my mom's a big slot machine gambler. <laughs> Very addicted. She's really, like, losing her mind on going to any casinos now that she's fully retired. So we were actually supposed to go to Laughlin this week. I, I would have been in Laughlin today if COVID did not happen. <laughs> But it's just too risky. A lot of things closed. Can't really do much anyways. Why put yourself at risk? You know, not a necessity. So we had to cancel that trip. But yeah, Laughlin's a cool little place. I've been going there since I was a little kid. My, my mom has always loved going there instead of Vegas. You know, much more chill there. More family. Nice. So in Washington, except there's a lot of, yeah. 
I mean, like I said, I think every state and city has its own perks and has something that makes you want to stay there, you know? But. That is a true, that's actually pretty true, man. Yeah, I mean, if you move out of California, you're, you're probably, it's going to be really hard for you to afford to moving back, right? That's kind of true. Where it's like, kind of might as well stick around and, uh, and kind of invest into a place. I mean, unless you're already retired, you know, you got your pension and everything. You, you sell your house here in, Ca in California, you sell it for some good money, and then you retire to, like, another state where it's, like, half the cost. I know a buddy of mine. Um, he was still working, actually. But um, his wife retired. They sold their house in Pomona. You know, I think he said he got, like, $300,000. They still stayed in California. They moved to Temecula. Right, and and they bought like a, a house with like an acre of land for like a hundred and something thousand. This was like maybe seven years ago now. And was able to keep the other half of the money, right? So over like a hundred and fifty, two hundred thousand and well they're retired now, you know, and they got all this extra money in case you know, I think he bought a new car because his car was kinda old and stuff like that, so But I mean that's something like that, obviously that's where it works out. Nice, draw. All right, guys, last box. AJ Dillon. <laughs> yeah, Needles is like, <laughs> yeah, Needles is a very, very small city in Nevada, and I mean it's pretty much Laughlin, but I guess you can still call it Needles. Yeah, Justin Herbert, but yeah, it's it's pretty cool. I mean. It, Laughlin's is the, the casinos are right off the Colorado River, so that's kind of cool. You know, a little more beat down now, much older, but I know one of the nicer casinos in, in Laughlin, the Aquarius, like, bought the Colorado Bell, bought, like, the Edgewater, and are, like, renovating it, trying to revive it. And, like, the main casino that the Riverside, I think it's called, yeah. It was named after the guy that they invented or named Laughlin, Don Laughlin. They're like, they renovated the Riverside now too. Nice pool, nice everything. So, you know, hopefully nicer place to go to. I mean, obviously you can't really be Vegas, but the price for Vegas is pretty expensive now. Vegas is not about gambling anymore. It's just entertainment now. LaMichael Piran. I think the casinos might have been there, Rex. I, I just don't think they were probably as big, but they, it, they were there. I don't know. I mean, I don't know if you drove to Laughlin, but they're they're right off the Colorado River. So like, if you cross the bridge, Tom Brady. Uh, it's like Bullhead City, I believe. Arizona. Lamar Jackson. Yeah, I've been going there since a little kid, so I know the casinos are there. And the casinos have been there since like the nineties. Spellbound. And Gabriel Davis, purple ink, for the Bills, going to Jeffrey. T. Higgins. Marlon Davidson. Kyler Murray. Jordan Love. Terry McLaurin. Dalvin Cook. Paul McDonald had a farm. Yeah, yeah, yo. And a little die kit here of Cameron Dantzler.
Alrighty guys, so there you go guys. A lot of inserts, a lot of number cards that'll be top loaded. Um, I'm sure there's some autos in here that I didn't top load, but Elite some really nice stuff guys. Uh, you know, unfortunately this was a half case break, so if you didn't hit much, you know, hopefully the next one we do. Um, so if your team is available in the next half guys, uh, fresh case number three and four. And then here were like the pen pals. So Gabriel Davis, we have Carson Wentz Relic, AJ Dillon to 99, KJ Hamler to 99. We got Darrington Evans, Cole Kmet, uh, Jonathan Taylor to 99, James Morgan for the Jets, Jake Fromm, passing the torch, Len Dawson, Tom Brady, 6 out of 12, that I insert, out of 5, Nico Harmon, and investment pick right here, Jordan Love, J Hart, Otto, for the Green Bay Packers. So, um, I know there was a couple of those inserts that'll be like four players. I don't have a pen here, do I? So, we'll get one as an example if I have one here. So, I'm just going to randomize them, but it has like four players on them. So, we're just going to go by. There's like one player here, and then three other players right here. This would be like one, two, three, and four. And we'll just randomize one through four. Uh, whatever player number it hits, then that'll go to that team right there for the inserts. So let's roll the dice, list. And like I said, we'll go one, two, three, or four on the front side too. Roll it, and we got a one and a five for six times. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So six times four. So it's going to go to the last player over here. Appreciate it, guys. Again, another elite uh, pick your team on the website. Pick your team number three from a fresh case. Jaspiescasebreaks.com.